He saw what was in the heart of people in the time of Noah. That it was evil continually. That there was only wickedness and violence in their hearts. And if anybody knows whether somebody has the capacity to change or not, it is God. And he saw their hearts and recognized that they had no capacity or ability to change. Amen. We don't have the right to do that. Uh, we don't have the right to, to write somebody off and say they, they're no hope. You know, we've said that about folks sometimes. Oh, uh, they're no hope. They're, there's no way. <laughs> there's no way they're ever going to change. Amen. Maybe some, of, some people said that about you. Amen. But you're here today. But only God is the one who knows whether somebody has the capacity to, to repent and to change. And so God said, I will destroy man whom I have created from the face of the earth, both man and beast, creeping thing and birds of the air, for I am sorry that I have made him. He was sorry that he had made man, that every single one of them would be judged and will be destroyed. But, but there's a problem here. This would mean that this would spell the end of, of God's most prized creation, mankind. Until you get to verse number eight, and we see that, we see that wonderful verse. But Noah found grace in the eyes of the Lord. Amen. Amen. The whole world was doomed for destruction because they were beyond repentance. They were reprobate, as the New Testament would call it. They were beyond change. But there was a family, there was one man and his family that found grace in the eyes of the Lord. And this brings to us another question. Why is it that it was only Noah that found grace in the eyes of the Lord? Have you ever asked that? Why is it that it was only this man and his family that found grace in the eyes of the Lord? And the answer is usually found in Scripture and in the nearest context, which is the very next verse. It says in verse 9 of Genesis 6, this is the genealogy of Noah. Noah was a just man. There it is. He was perfect in his generations, and Noah walked with God. Noah found grace because he was a just man, perfect or whole in his generation. He was a man of integrity. And he walked with God. And, and these characteristics are what God saw in Noah that he found grace. He saw within this man a, a willingness, an ability, a teachable spirit and heart that somehow he had the capacity to do right. He wasn't perfect in the sense that he never committed sin. But there was a heart within him that was willing to be obedient to the voice of God. 